Hey you guys, welcome to Nerd Stalker. I am Adolfo Ferranda. Today I'm going to show you Jujutsu Nerds how to create a journal, or anyone if you want to make any kind of journal within Evernote. Um, automatically, sort of a workflow automated process using Keyboard Maestro. So to show you how this thing works really quick, I will just, let's just run it real quick. Uh, on my computer, my hotkey is Control Option B. So I hit Control Option B, I'm prompted to select an instructor. I select a particular instructor, I hit OK, and it's off to the races. I switch to another notebook, which I've titled BJJ Journal, and it automatically puts in the date, automatically puts in the instructor's name that I selected, and pastes in other sort of prompts for me to enter to start journaling. So you saw how quick that is, instantaneous. It can really keep you sort of consistent with journaling. So let's jump to Keyboard Maestro to see how this works. So in Keyboard Maestro, in my Evernote group, I named this thing BJJ Journal Entry. It is triggered by the hotkey Control Option B, as I mentioned previously. Uh, I have a note in here just to let you know that the name has to be this uh, BJJ Journal, or if you want to change it, uh, you can change it. You can customize this whole thing however you want, this particular recipe or macro. And OK, so here I select, I chose to use a prompt for user input. Uh, the title being instructor, and then the variable and default values. Uh, I use the instructor variable. I called it instructor, and then my very my values being the names of the instructors separated by a pipe. That's that straight line. So it'd be like this: no space, you know, name, uh, space, or uh, pipe, and then name, and then pipe, and then I have an OK button and a cancel button. After that, I have I utilize a lot of the Evernote built-in keyboard uh, shortcuts so that I don't have to get all fancy here, which is awesome. You might as well just lever leverage the power of your particular application that you're using. So with that, I hit Command-J, and what that does is jumps to a notebook. So after I hit Command-J, I pause for 0.5 seconds. I enter so I can paste in the name of my particular notebook, and then I pause for four seconds. A lot of pausing going on, right? So that just give the application time to sort of catch up with what you're doing. Otherwise, Keyboard Maestro works so fast. And then I hit the return key. What that's doing is the, it's saying OK to the search, right, by hitting the return search. And then it pauses for five seconds so that you get a return value and you're in that particular notebook. And then it, you hit uh, Command N, which is a new note in Evernote. That pauses for 0.4 seconds. And then this shift command D command within Evernote is automatically fills in the date. You get that out of the box. It's fantastic in your title field so that you don't have to fiddle with that. And then I just wait a little bit, 0.4 seconds down here. I hit the tab key so it jumps down from the title field to your body of your note field. And then it simply pastes in all of this stuff, and meaning it also uh, paste in the the label instructor, it paste in the value that's selected of the instructor, and then paste in the rest of this these uh, prompts. And these prompts were pretty much lifted or inspired by um, notebooks that you can buy, print jujitsu notebooks that you can buy online or whatever. Uh, but I choose, since we choose to do it in Evernote, why not just leverage their particular prompts, uh, sort of best of breed stuff here. Um, you can pare it down, customize it as you wish, obviously, but I found these to be uh, particularly helpful. Let's go back to Evernote and see how this works one more time now that I've sort of broken down the explanation. So we go to a different notebook just to prove that it does jump to another notebook, my jujitsu notebook. My particular prompt being control option B, I type it in, boom, our prompt for our instructor. Uh, select a particular instructor, hit OK. It searches for the notebook we want to be in. It jumps to the new notebook being called BJJ Journal. Automatically entered in the date in the title. Pasted in the instructor and the instructor's name that we selected automatically and pasted in the rest of the prompts that we chose. I hope you find use for it. Really simple, really fun to uh, pop this guy out real quick and hopefully it inspires you to uh, journal more with for your particular need. Uh, in this case, jujitsu. I found it really helpful. Uh, I love the art and the sport. So uh, it's really great. Again, my name is Adolfo Ferranda and you are watching Nerd Stalker. Check us out at nerdstalker.com, Nerd Stalker TV on YouTube and all the places. Thanks for your time.